Hey Tom, what are you doing? Uh, what I'm doing uh, and has been on the go for a bit is I'm actually trying to get myself a workshop. So, so the, the job here is to get a functioning workshop. And how are you doing it, Tom? So how I'm doing it is bit by bit, a uh, little bit by little bit, and the uh, and recycled material, mostly recycled material and a bit of new stuff. Uh, and uh, yeah, it, it's uh, um, what's happening here is a lot of rain comes into the the building, and so I don't have the protection. So we're just uh, stopping that rain coming in, and I don't have any workbenches. I don't have any shelves to put all my gear. Uh, so um, I'll be doing that piece by piece and um, and getting it yeah rainproofed and and uh, yeah that's how we're doing it and why are you doing it Tom why am I doing it I do a bit of building uh, as you can see uh, of our, um, our, our structures and things like that um, and I also have machines and if you have machines you need a workshop for maintenance machines need maintenance and I'm really really get behind on my maintenance all the time and so I focus mostly on the property. You know, we've been here 15 years, moving towards 16 years. I focused on the systems of the property, the fertility systems, the planting systems, the animal systems. I focused a lot on that, but I've never worked on my workshop so much, a little bit here and there. And I lose a lot of time trying to find my stuff because I, I, I've got nothing on shelves, everything's on the ground, everything's stacked on each other. And it's very inefficient and it's really, really uh, can be expensive if you don't do maintenance on your machines. Um, I know machines are not sustainable, so I don't have many machines, but uh, I, I the ones I do, I need to maintain them better than I am. And also, um, it's, it's expensive getting someone else to do machines, and I have uh, some basic skills that I've picked up being on farms and things all my life and being in the in building industry to, to maintain my machines. And if you maintain your machines properly, they work better and your tools are much better, they last longer and also they're out of the weather. So hopefully, I don't know how organised I'll be, I'm probably not going to be that organised, but, but um, I'll have some organisation to have my, all my tools and machines and uh, other bits and pieces. And I've got nowhere to tinker. I, I, I start building something, I've got to pull it away, put the car back or whatever it is, and I've got nowhere to tinker on things. We've got some stoves coming up that I need to build to um, some Arga stoves. Uh, I've got to make two, one out of two, and I need space to do that, to set it up and, and get all the bits and pieces right. So I need benches and all that I don't have, and it's overdue, it's time to do it. So winter's coming, and I, I need to get those, those stoves done, so I need to get this happening. So it's really good, push, 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 move forward, and uh, eventually get a bit of a space for me to be able to do my bits.